Today on Outside the Box Reviews, it's Figure Wars. And today we are looking at three different versions of the 1995 incarnation of Godzilla from Godzilla vs. Destroya, also known as Burning Godzilla. From left to right we have the 2002 Bandai Creations Burning Godzilla, the 2015 NECA Godzilla vs. Destroya figure, and the 2012 Bandai Tamashii Nations SH Monster Arts Burning Godzilla. The figures we are looking at today not only span many years, but many price points. The Creations figure originally retailed for about 10 bucks. The NECA figure retails for around 18 and the Monster Arts went for a whopping $87 when it came out, almost five times the cost of the NECA release and about nine times the cost of the Creations. For accessories, both the NECA and Creation figures have nothing. The Monster Arts Godzilla comes with two unique freeze tanks from Godzilla vs. Destroya. Sculpt and paint varies greatly between each figure. While the Creations figure is black vinyl painted in oranges and reds to simulate the burning effect, NECA's version is made from a light orange translucent plastic with glossy black paint over top. The Monster Arts figure uses a translucent orange plastic with a yellow backing and a red paint wash to create its burning effect, topped with a matte charcoal gray flesh tone. All three figures feature fiery yellow eyes. In standard Bandai Creation style, that figure has its teeth sculpted into a chunk of black vinyl in its mouth, while the other two feature individually sculpted dual rows of teeth. Both NECA and Monster Arts have translucent orange spines with charcoal gray centers, while Creation shares the same color scheme but without the translucent effect. The Creation spines are made from the same vinyl the rest of the figure is made from, NECA uses a gummy plastic, and Monster Arts uses the same hard plastic that makes up its body. NECA and Creations have equal length tails, Creations lacks any paint on the tail spines, while the others have white spines. The Monster Arts figure also features a longer tail than his rivals. Another unique feature to the Monster Arts release is the interchangeable hands, going from a more open to a more closed position. For articulation, all three figures can move their heads from side to side, NECA and Monster Arts have a further degree of motion with ball joints allowing up, down, and tilting movement. NECA and Monster Arts also feature articulated jaws. The NECA and Monster Arts figures feature ball jointed shoulders. All three feature bicep swivels, with NECA and Monster Arts featuring additional joints in their upper arms and elbows, as well as their wrists. A unique feature to the NECA version is articulated fingers. The Creations figure has no articulation in the chest. NECA has one point and Monster Arts has two. All three can move their legs forward and backwards. NECA and Monster Arts can also move in and out of the hips, bend at the knee, and bend and swivel at the ankles. All three can rotate at the top of the tail. NECA features a few ball jointed segments near the base of the tail, then transitions into a bendy wire. Monster Arts features a fully ball jointed tail. These three are just a few of many different releases of Burning Godzilla figures that have been released over the years. Each has its own style and characteristics. At the end of the day, I feel that the NECA figure being twice the price of the creations is fitting. It's at least twice the figure. I can't say that the Monster Arts figure is five times the figure that the NECA one is, but it is a great release with incredible detail and paint. But let me know in the comments below, how do you think these figures stack up with one another? Also let me know if you're liking this new style I'm trying out for Figure Wars, and if you want to see any of the individual or former Figure Wars reviews for these figures, click the links in the description below. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, username Outside the Box Reviews. Also follow me on Facebook, link below. And until next time, this war is over.